The Children's Day special broadcast continues, and this time we're joining Abdul Jabbar Sahad for the latest stories from Adama State. The Adama State government has approved a negative review of the state budget by 24%. The State Executive Council says this rule affects only the capital expenditure and overhead cost of the budget. The decision was reached, uh, was reached after a review of the situation considering the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic on the state economy. The state governor, Governor Ahmad Fintri, said the budget review will soon be transmitted to the state assembly for consideration and approval. In another story, the governor of Rivers has ordered prosecution of 14 individuals from Adamawa State. They were apprehended while moving cattle into Putakot from the state in breach of the state government's directive on border closure and lockdown of the state. Governor Wiki said he also ordered the auction of the cattle and the two trucks in which they were being conveyed. One of the arrested individuals claimed they had paid 1,500 naira to, sec to security agents to breach the state's border. That's all for now. I am Abu Jabbar Saad reporting from the Plus TV Africa's Children's Day Special News Edition. Thank you, Abdul Jabbar. Now to other news stories. Again, Abdul Jabbar Sahad brings us more stories from the Bauchi State. In the light of the COVID 19 pandemic, the Bauchi State's primary healthcare development agency says the state government spends 1,500 naira per meal for admitted COVID 19 patients and provides them three meals each day. This is to make the patients feel at home and avoid approaches like in some other states. Bochi has also been taking steps to ease lockdown measures like lifting bans on religious gatherings since May the 21st, 2020. The Governor Bala Muhammad announced this during a stakeholders meeting on May the 20th and says the state is working towards lifting the lockdown completely. Governor Muhammad says the state has so far successfully managed the pandemic, which is evident in the massive number of recoveries in the state. This is the latest news from Bochi State. I'm Abu Jabari Ayesa reporting from Plus TV Africa's Children's Day Special News. Have a good day.